Welcome back to my channel. Happy Thursday and happy Dollar Tree haul day. So I have a big bag, which you probably saw on the thumbnail. It was just too heavy to lift up. I can't remember what is that heavy in there. It's probably something to drink, knowing me. But I've got a Dollar Tree haul for you guys. So I hope everybody's having a wonderful day. I'm going to do this, and then i got to go vacuum out my car, run it through the car wash, and then back here to Walmart, I'm in Walmart parking lot to grab stuff for dinner. So, um, anyway, I got one of these because, I don't know, if you saw, like, m one of my posts, um, like, TikTok or Instagram, you will see that I did plant some tomatoes and peppers, and I do have some flowers and stuff, and I've been trying to remember to water those bad boys. Right now, I have a gallon jug, you know, that I just carry the water in. Which, you know, it does the trick. But I just thought this would be cuter setting with it. I love the green color. It just reminds me of, like, you know, plants and stuff, I guess, because it's green. I don't know. I just don't know. But, yeah. I don't know what all I have in here. This this bag has been in here a while. Um, wow. I just hauled these the day before yesterday. So, I had gotten a pack and didn't realize it. But we always need batteries, like always. So this is the Panasonic Triple A's. Definitely, we'll be using them. Okay. And then I saw these because I, or I got these because I don't ever remember seeing these before. And here's what they are. It's the Gamesa, Gamesa, I'm not exactly sure, Classics. It's the Mara Villas. I don't know. I have no idea if it's like a sugar cookie. Let's see if it says on here. Vanilla flavored cookies. So this vanilla flavored little, maybe like if you're having like a cup of tea and you have a saucer, you can put two or three cookies on there to go with your tea. I think that would be really cute for that. But grabbed those. And I did find, which since then I have found more so, I don't really feel like it's in, you know, like it's disappearing. But I did get um, two more of these right here. And it's the palm olive spray aways. And I like this stuff. I have used it. I like it. I gave Fifi a bottle of it. And I have a bag of stuff to give to Josh at Halley. And I've got them a bottle of it in there. And I just thought, you know, they're probably not going to be carrying this regularly. So I thought I would go ahead and grab two more bottles just in case, like, they run out. You know, I don't want to, I don't want to not be able to find it and want some more. So I grabbed those. I'm just going to lay them up there. Um, this is something that I had never seen before. And I think this is name brand, honestly. Because I think, like, some of the nail stuff that I've been getting is this same brand. It's the Sensational brand. So, here's what it is. It's the Sensational French Tip Pen. So, it's white, two easy steps, and you can make your own French tips. I thought that was kind of cool. I think French tips on the toes look really neat. I think I'll give some of the, one of these to Fifi. Because she, you know, she likes to do French tips on her, her toes. I've seen them before. So, I don't really know how to do this. It just says white French tip pen. I guess this is just white. You probably do the tips, you know, and then maybe go over it with this right here, which is probably like a top coat. I'm sure it can't be too hard, but I, I grabbed two of them. If I decide I won't use them, then I will probably put one in like the 20K giveaway. So, there'll be a couple of winners in the 20K giveaway, um, but they may be a, a few different items in the boxes as well. So... I do have my receipt here, so if you guys are interested in the Fetch app, um, you can scan your receipts and you earn, like, free gift cards for, like, Dunkin' Donuts, Starbucks, Amazon, you know, all tons of different places, Bed Bath & Beyond. Um, if you want my referral code, I think you can get 2,000 points whenever you uh, initially sign up. Just ask me for it in the comments or it'll be in the description box. I'm not going to put it up there because last time I put it up there, 
And when I opened the door at Walmart, a suction of air came through, grabbed my receipt, and sent it flying out over the parking lot. And there's no way I could have ran for that. No way. There's no way I could have caught. By the time I would have, like, even shut my door, it probably was three stores over. I hate to litter, but sometimes things like that happens. And what can I say? Okay, so I got this, and I'm like, what is this? Number one. It's from April Bath and Showers. It's a bath soap pouch. And this thing feels really, really cool. Let me see if I can get it out of here. Like, what, what is holding it in here? I don't really know. I've never seen these. Bath soap pouch. So, it says, just slip your soaps in and close the top by pulling on the cord. The mesh creates more lather and less, less waste. A convenient or something. Oh, cord, I guess, lets you hang up when you're done. Oh, but like, is this like, like, do you use this? Like, you put your soap in and you use this on your body and then hang it up when you're done. Leave your soap in and hang it up. Is that what happens? Like, I don't feel like that would be like the most, well, I guess it would be like one of the, um, the scr scr scrunchy thing. What are they called? I don't know. But I guess it'd be something like that. I guess you would put your own whatever soap. Like, this would be personalized. Like, everybody in the shower would not use this. I think I'll put me a, uh, a caress up in here. And let me just see. There's something. I guess this is supposed to simulate a bar of soap. You stick it in there, and then you just, do you just, like that? Like, I don't know. I've never seen these. If you've seen them, let me know. I'm just curious. But it feels really cool. They want a string. Um, it feels really neat, so I'll be interested in trying that out with a nice bar of caress. And then I told you guys that I thought I may have uh, bought these already, but I, I didn't know if they would be like in a different scent or not. So they're not, but I will share with like um, Fifi and Josh and Hallie. Um, or I may put one in the 20K. I don't know. So this is from Beauty and Planet. It is the vetiver and jojoba 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 i don't know everybody's always tell see here's the thing i'm not sure um and people tell me different things so i'm like who's right i don't know i've always called it jojoba and that's what i'm just going to continue calling it okay just for the heck of it but this is the same thing so i do have three of these now but let me smell did i smell it already this is the oily yes I even sprayed it. It's like oily. It's like oil to spray on your hair, and it smells good, and it's definitely nice and oily, uh, but I always spray or use oil, love oil on my hair anyway after I wash it, and then I was, I grabbed this brush because sometimes I just need like a brush, just, you know, just a regular brush, and the, the other one that I have is kind of big, and sometimes I just want like a regular brush, you know, just to even throw it in your purse if you want to. And this one has purple sparkles. I love the color of it. And like, I'll probably get rid of one of my old brushes. My hubby has a brush and I try not to use his brush because if I use it like, and it gets like long red hairs in it, like he doesn't like that too good. So I usually don't even touch his brush because, you know, we all need our own brush anyway. So anyway, I, I thought I'd get this and see how it does. Like some of the Dollar Tree brushes like won't even go through my hair. It's really weird, but this one will. I know this one will because of the type of brush it is. So yes, there's that. All right. Now I see what's so heavy in here and I got two of these because my son absolutely loved them. He asked me if I would get some more if I saw them. Well, this one store that I go to is like the only one that carries these. So there are two four packs in here and it is the Lindauer Zing. It's 60% pure apple juice, 40% sparkling water. So it's like sparkling apple juice, which is kind of cool. Um, but he absolutely loves them better than just regular like sparkling water. So, yes. Okay. So, I have been looking for these bigger boxes. And I got these in the tool, the tool 
bench section and I got these to put my Shein earrings in because I have this thing like hanging on my door that I have like all my earrings in or some of my earrings but like it's so packed i can never find like the earrings that i'm wanting to wear for the day <gasps> omg i don't have earrings on how ridiculous is that when i own like a hundred thousand pairs you know i got out of there without my earrings and that is absolutely ridiculous but anyway i bought two of these and i'm just gonna put like my shein earrings because those are like my funkiest ones in there and then I have another one sort of like this, but it's a little bit smaller. I think it might have been like in the um, crafter square section. I want to put like all of my mystical, like my, my um, moons and stars. I know a lot of you guys have, have sent me like wonderful moons and stars earrings and stuff like that. I want to keep all of those together and like crystal earrings and stuff like that. So anyway, these have a little bit bigger compartments. And you know, some of my earrings are a little bit bigger. Those broccolis that I had on yesterday was really big. Um, but anyway, I got two of these just for Shein earrings. And I've got some stuff in my Shein cart on like my thing. And I'm like, oh, should I, should I? I don't know, I just don't know. Okay, this is something new that I, oh, what's going on Yeah. Okay, so powder just fell out of this. I don't know what that's all about. But these are, and I thought these were cute. These are Dove brand, which is cool. I like Dove brand stuff. This is a bath, it's two bath bombs. And this is in the scent Vanilla Raspberry Creamsicle. So I went ahead and grabbed two of these. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with them, but every time I find the name brand stuff, I really like to, you know, buy it because even if I don't use it, I can also always put it in like my giveaways. So this would be a cool item to put in like the giveaway, like the 20K giveaway. Um, if Fifi don't want any, um, which I don't think Fifi uses bath bombs, like she's like me, like we are shower people, like always shower people. So yes. And then I saw these, which I'm super excited about. This reminds me of those ones, which they are in the house, but I hauled like the last haul that I did. Um, and these are Lab 2, Lab to the second power. I don't even know. <laughs> it says, call, it's pro, call me Mr. Perfect. Okay. It's sponge applicators, and I love the packaging on these. Like, I think this is the same brand as the facial uh, scrubber that I got. Like, they're the matte black, super nice. But I love the packaging. Like, this is Boom Baby packaging right here. It's, it's gorgeous. I love the burst of purple in the yellow. I love it, and it just it gives you a little bit of tips on the back and this is like one of my favorite finds right here i love the shape of this so easy for like if you are putting like i um why does that that word always elude me um not base but hold on oh my gosh forget it i don't know concealer for one thing it's really good for concealer um but the other whatevs whatevs anyway i got two of those as well and then i got me now i was telling you guys like i had found like my favorite um lash of all times and that i you know i had used them and then i put i took them off one night and i put them when i was putting them in this spot i was thinking oh i'm probably gonna lose one so the next day when I went to get them and put my lashes on, one was gone and I couldn't find it. It's a, I don't know what happened to it, but I absolutely found some more. This is the Ioni. This is the Palace ones, which is the wispy, long, spiky. And that's like my fave. I just feel like they stand out more. The ones that I have on right now are spiky as well and I love them. And one of the things that I really had never done before, like whenever I was working with the lashes, was trimming them up. And, and that means not really the length of them, but just like if they're too long, you know, to be too on your eye. And here lately, I've been trimming my lashes, like before I put them on, and I like them so much better. I feel like they stay better. They, you know, they're just better if you trim them 
to suit your eye. So I ended up finding the palace ones. So I got me two of these. They will last a rather long time. Uh, sometimes I'm in the mood for the spiky dramatic. Sometimes I'm not. But when I am, these are definitely my lash of choice. Ioni brand is the bomb.com. I love them. Like, no other lashes. Like, Ioni is the bomb. Okay, and then I grabbed two more of these, which I have, or no, just one more of these. This is the Big Sexy Hair. This is the Blow Dry Voluminous Gel. And I actually had got me one of these, and then I showed them to Fifi and asked her if she wanted one, and she said yes. So I gave her one. So I grabbed me one more because I still had them. It smells good. It just smells good. Like, it smells, I can't wait to use it. Like, so it's the Big Sexy, and you know that this is definitely a name brand. So, boom, baby, grabbed that. And then I found another color. Here it is, the Sensational. Yes. So this is the gel color, um, and it says it lasts two weeks. You do need the UV light, but that's really not a problem because they sell the UV lights at Dollar Tree as well. So anyway, I found this color, which I hadn't found before, so I went ahead and got it. I think maybe, um, and let me know if you guys know this because I'm not sure, do you need a top coat? Like, is that something that I need to purchase for all of these gel nail kits I've been buying? Because I'm not sure. But I absolutely love that color. It is in the color um, Perfect Periwinkle. So that's a pretty, pretty color. Great for summer, too. And then the last two things that I have here is actually some more nail polish. And these are both China Glaze. And I love both of these. Like, I think they are both absolutely gorgeous. This is a frost color. Frost stuff always reminds me of the 80s. I love, love, love this color. And this is more of a matte, but, or not a matte. This is more of a non-frost, I guess. Um, but it's a mauve -y color. Let's see if there's names on here. Okay, here. Yes. My. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, we have to have our glasses. We have to. What do I do with them? I just had them because I had to do a video. Um, hold on, bear with me. Here they are. I did a Louis Vuitton unboxing over on TikTok. So if you're interested in, if you saw my box that I posted last night, on um, Instagram and you want to see what was in that Louis Vuitton box, go check out TikTok. Okay, so this one, the flat one, the flat mauve one is called My Lodge or Yours. Huh, cute. My Lodge or Yours. And then this nice 80s color, ooh, baby, I am loving that, is called As Good As It Glitz. Perfect. As good as it glitz. My gosh, I would love to have this on my toes. I still haven't done them. They're ready to go, but I'm, I've been trying to put it off because, like, my hubby wants that maroon color. I should have asked. I should have just did whatever color I wanted. Oh, wouldn't this be pretty on? I don't know. Maybe I'll just ignore what he said and just do my thing, right? Uh, yeah, I think I may. Huh. Anyway, um, I, that's my haul, guys. That is all I had in this bag, and I'm trying to... I've been trying to clean my car out and get, like, everything up out of the floorboards. I'm going to go vacuum my car out. Um, I don't know how hot it is. My thing is not sitting on the temperature outside yet. But it's probably going to be a pretty warm one today. Um, I'm going to go do that, wash my car, and then I'll be back to Walmart. So, I don't know why I'm telling you. This is not even a vlog. So, anyway, these are... I just love these. I just can't get over these. I guess I'll do a little TikTok and show some of this stuff really quick. Um, but anyway, just want to say thank you guys for watching. Let me just ask, if you are not subscribed to my channel and you like this type of video, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. We are coming up on 18,000 viewers. And I just want to say I created some shirts the other day, actually yesterday. I posted them over on Instagram. The pictures are not very good. They don't really do them justice, but I did make some extra shirts, and I just want to say one of the shirts say extra AF. That is not for everyone. You know, some people do not, don't like that term, um, but some people do. So I went ahead and just created one, but you could 
say the extra AF means and fabulous even, you know. But anyway, I love the other ones. The other ones are actually my favorite anyway. But I'm going to be doing giveaways on when I reach uh, 18K and when I reach 19K. So I'll be drawing names and I'll tell you how to enter whenever the time comes. And then I will let you choose whatever extra shirt that you want and I will have it sent to you in your size. So anyway, I just want to say thank you guys for watching and have a wonderful day. And until next time, bye!